Hello everyone, this is Lollipop one MLE here today with another episode of Lollipop Speed Art and the 7th or 6th episode of my AG Historical and Be Forever at Hogwarts project. Now we're continuing into the Larsons portion of this. So for those that don't know, yes I am doing Kirsten and some of her family and Honestly, yeah, like I, I don't want to go into the struggles of how I was doing Kirsten and while I was do in the process of making this, I lost the, um, the footage of me doing um, her fate, like her fate, like coloring and shading her face and hair and all that shiz. I'm not going to get into that. I accidentally, but long story short, I accidentally delete that file and I'm upset about that. So anyways, this is corresponding with the uh, 10th anniversary of my YouTube channel. So yeah, this video is going to go up. Like as you are watching this, as of this video, it's going to be up on the 10th anniversary, September 15th. Well, I'm recording this like um, 12 days in advance. But anyways, I started Kirsten into Hufflepuff. Because, like, if you know, like, Kirsten and you've done the research, she is one of the most adorable characters ever. Oh, and her outfit is based off of her winter outfit that was released. So, anyways, like I said, all these are going to be up on my DeviantArt and all that stuff. And I gave her a wintry setting for this one. So, I'm sorry for the shortness of this one, but here's Kirsten completed. So... Next person I did was Kirsten's older brother, Lars, and I started him into Gryffindor, and again, he's like a few years older than Kirsten and all that stuff, and I gave him like, you know, a typical pioneer-ish, um, mid-Victorian, um, kind of suit thing, but it has like, he's wearing a vest and a hat and all that stuff. Again, like like Kirsten, like getting into Kirsten's story, her and her family are immigrants to America. They live in the Minnesota Territory. They settled there. They're from Sweden and all that stuff. And I do have the first book. I I don't I haven't read all the books, but from like the first book, it basically it was tragic. Like in terms of uh, Kirsten and her like friend Marta. I, in, in case you don't know, I did not do Marta or the other character, Kate characters, main char uh, you know, the characters that I am able to sort because Marta did pass away during the events of the first story and all that stuff. So with Lars, Lars was pretty simple and from what I read he like was good with like woodwork and log work so I made him do that like putting up some wood in the summertime and here's Lars completed and I was pretty impressed with this one though and next I did these next two together I did Lisbeth and Anna now Lisbeth and Anna are Kirsten's cousins now, something interesting to know is that from the research I, when I was looking up the characters, um, Lisbeth came to America when she was just a baby with um, Aunt Ingrid, 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 or uh, I can't pronounce it, but anyways, and then she had Anna in the States, and then her first husband died. Uh, like six or seven years before the events of the first book and she married Kirsten's uncle Olaf so that is how um these girls are related sorry um guys yeah they are related by Mare they're space technically they're step cousins but no they're cousins guys and they pretty much love each other they like they're like sisters already and like I looked up what they look like um with um Lizbeth she has like blue gray eyes and brown hair and Anna has blue eyes and golden hair so I did that and I one thing I regret 
doing that, um, Lizbeth was, I forgot her crown braid. Like, I should have put her crown braid in there. And Anna had, like, of course, I gave her two regular braids, like Kirsten. And, of course, their outfits are pretty similar to Kirsten's um, outfit slash Hogwarts uniform that I came up with. Now, for the sorting, I sorted Lizbeth into Slytherin. Like, spoiler alert, I did order into Slytherin, and I sorted Anna into Hufflepuff. Because, let, let me let you guys in on a little secret. Hufflepuffs and Slytherins get along best. Yeah, they always say Hufflepuffs get along with Gryffindor well and Ravenclaws get along with Slytherin. But guess what? Hufflepuff and Slytherin get along the best. They're basically like, they're very, basically Slytherin will kill for Hufflepuff. They will... They will give each other hugs. Anyways, um, I did a pretty good job with these two. So anyways, next episode will be on Addie and her family and friends. All th these three pieces are up on my DeviantArt. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos in the future. Like, share, follow me on Twitter and Instagram as well. And I'll see you for the next video. Peace out.